Hello! After long last, it is finally finished. Uh, this is the final version. Uh, this one is now controlled by this remote control. Uh, it also has buttons on the top of the clock as well, so if the batteries run dead on this, you can still control it. So, on this one now, um, I can turn the LEDs on and off by the remote control. Um, you can set the preset colours. Um, and you have white as well. And then you can also dim. Uh, you've also got uh, Fash. No idea why you bought that, but there you go. It's on the remote control, so it's on the clock. Uh, strobe. Pretty cool for a nightclub, I think. Uh, we have colour switching. This basically cycles through all the colours that are on the remote. And then we have colour fade. Um, this would be great for a nightlight, I, I think. So the other cool features are that if you hold the on button on the remote, it goes into setup. You can turn the alarm on and off. Um, you can change the alarm time. So it's hours and minutes. You can change the clock display from 12 hours to 24 hours. Um, and you can change the clock hour clock minute and then you're back to the start so to exit setup mode you just press the off button on the remote and then you're back into normal mode so let's uh, set the alarm and then uh, demonstrate that so it's 11.03 so alarm on So we'll turn it off, and there you go, that's the alarm going off. So, that was a good timing. Um, so to put it into snooze, you put any button on the remote control apart from the off button. And then that will give you a 10 minute snooze. And then to stop the alarm, you press the off button on the remote. And as you can see, the light is now static, which means the alarm is not active and it's ready, set for the following day. Um, yeah, I think that's about it.